What's going on everyone? Today we're gonna to be showing you six of our favorite ab exercises to really help you get some chiseled and popping out abs. I'm gonna start with my three favorites and Kyle's gonna jump into his. So let's get right into it. Number one for me has gotta be the cable wood chopper. I love these because I can physically feel the tension transferring throughout my obliques, going to my rectus abdominis and really moving through that motion. I find it's really great because you can really have those obliques pop and really work them in motion and stride. We're not doing a ton of rotary movement. So these are a must add to your routine. Number two, quite simply, is the cable crunch. I love this one. It's a little advanced because it's hard to get a good feel in it. So as always, if you go to the description, we have how to's for every single one of these exercises. So make sure to watch them if you don't know how to properly do them. But if you do, you're laughing because you know this is an amazing way to add added weight to your ab exercises. So definitely be sure to do the cable crunch. Number three is quite simply any variant of leg raises. This is my personal favorite way to work your lower abs. It's also a great movement to really enforce stability throughout the motion. You're holding yourself, you're bracing yourself in place, whether you're on a captain's chair, whether you're doing hanging, whatever it is, and it really forces you to learn to engage those lower abs, practice lifting the tension of your legs, and in my opinion, it's really great, especially the leaner you get, you can really see the chisels start to pop out there, and that's how you can really build out that bottom part of your six pack. Before we jump into my favorite three exercises, I just wanted to let you know, if you're someone who's been struggling to get that ab definition and finally lose that last little bit of belly fat, these are great exercises, but we've gotta get you in a calorie deficit, we gotta get you tracking, and basically with our coaching program, we take care of everything, your workout routine, your nutrition system, your accountability, so right now, we're looking for three more dedicated people who are looking to lose that last layer of stomach fat. Apply now, first thing in the description, first three inquiries will be accepted. One of my personal favorites is the oblique landmine twist. Now once again, as Josh was saying, we always have to have rotary motion for the abs. A lot of times people just do crunches and they just do things that aren't gonna be as super beneficial, but we've gotta make sure to target the obliques. So we obviously have a form video on this, but keeping your arms nice and straight, core tight, all the way over, side to side. This is great, but also it's gonna be nice because you can load up some nice weights. Obviously keep it, you know, keep your ego at the door. You don't wanna be doing too heavy, but it's nice because you can also pump up those shoulders and get some good stability work, some good rotary work. And this is just one of my overall favorites for really chiseling that last little bit of lower body fat. So number five is gonna be a weighted decline crunch. Now these are absolutely fantastic. And one of the things is a lot of times people just spend so much time doing regular crunches with no weight and everything like that. And if you're someone who wants to obviously get even block your abs and just create a a very very strong core and a nice core you've got to add some weight as you can tell a lot of these exercises we've added load so on the screen here you can see basically just doing these crunches are absolutely fantastic you can literally add up to 45 pounds and it gets you just really to keep everything nice and tight and it's just a fantastic exercise and last but not least just wanted to leave this one because I absolutely love them is any type of rollout variation now you can do something as you can see on the screen with a barbell you can do it with an ab wheel they're super cheap and affordable and you can keep it wherever or even if you don't have access you can do like a TRX where you kind of like set up here and then just allow yourself to fall forward, get a nice stretch and then bring it back here, okay? So these are fantastic and you know, obviously having a sore stomach the next day isn't gonna be the end all be all, but there is something just so satisfying about just ripping up your abs and just getting that nice feeling knowing, hey, I did something. So hey, try these out. If you've enjoyed it, let us know down in the description or comment section, which is your favorite. And if you are looking to lose that last little bit of lower stomach fat and just get to the next level on your fitness journey, we're your guys, you know, apply now and we appreciate every single one of you. Smash that like button, peace out.